Love at its highest crest is agape. Agape is the Greek word that the New Testament scriptures use to convey what God is. Uh, Agape love is a river that flows through the depths of all understanding. It is a love that gazes upon the landscape of a person's life, knowing every scar, every triumph, every shadow, and every ray of light. Yet, in this knowing, there is no judgment, no condemnation, no anger, just pure acceptance. It forgives without condition. It sees beyond the stories, beyond the shame, beyond the guilt, beyond the doubt, and it just eradicates any sense of unworthiness. It wholeheartedly embraces the essence of a person's being, bringing them healing and remembrance of their true self. In other words, when we encounter agape love, we are not only coming into contact with the divine, with God, but we are also coming into contact with who we really are. This love is beyond all judgment or expectation. It is a masterpiece of mercy and understanding where forgiveness flows freely and grace shines with unwavering radiance. We see Jesus exemplify this kind of love towards the woman at the well. Uh, She was burdened with her past mistakes and the labels that society had placed upon her. And Jesus knew everything about her history, about all of her past mistakes, yet he approached her with radical acceptance, compassion, and love. This is what agape is all about. Agape love isn't some transactional deal where you earn points or pass a test. It's this fierce, unyielding force that knows you inside and out, all the messy bits and the shining moments, and it still chooses to love you. It's like the universe is saying, I see you, all of you, and I'm not going anywhere. Agape love doesn't care about your past mistakes or even your future uncertainties. It's not keeping track of your slip-ups or holding on to any grudges. It's just this relentless current that flows through time and space, inviting you to step into the river of grace to let go of the burdens you carry and to just be as you are. With agape, it's not just about being loved, it's much more than that actually. It's about learning how to love yourself. Agape love invites you to embrace your own humanness, to forgive yourself for the things you regret, and to celebrate the beauty that's uniquely you. It's a love that calls you to extend that same compassion to others by viewing them beyond their mistakes and recognizing the divine light that dwells within them. This love is unwavering at the very core. It can literally know everything about a person and still love them fully. That's the radical mind-bending truth of agape love. It's not about fitting into some mold or meeting some impossible standard. It's about embracing your messy, beautiful, complicated self and realizing that you are loved beyond measure, just as you are. In the tapestry of existence, agape love threads through the fabric of our souls, connecting us to the divine essence that dwells within us all. It's a love that transcends the confines of ego and desire and it embraces each being with a boundless compassion that reveals the ultimate truth of unity consciousness. You see, agape love is the recognition that we are all fragments of the same cosmic symphony, each note essential to the harmony of the whole. When the veils of illusion fall away, agape love emerges as the purest expression of our interconnectedness, reminding us that in loving others, we love ourselves, and in loving ourselves, we encounter God. 
Let this agape love remind you that you are loved not in spite of your humanness, but because of it. Agape love transcends the limited definitions of right and wrong, good and bad, and whispers softly, you are a part of me and I am a part of you. Agape love is a cosmic force that's been here since the beginning. It's completely uncontainable, unexplainable, and utterly relentless. It's not some neat and tidy love that fits in a box. No, it, it's a wild, untamed force that breaks down walls and shatters expectations. You see, agape love isn't about checking off boxes or earning brownie points. It's about being fully present, fully alive in this moment. It's about recognizing that every single person, every single being, is a part of this beautiful dance we call life. It's a love that sees past the labels and judgments, cutting straight to the heart of who we really are. Agape love is a radical invitation to step outside of our comfort zones, to get real and vulnerable. It's not about playing it safe. It's about embracing the uncertainty, the vulnerability, and the sheer beauty of the unknown. It's about giving without expecting, about showing up even when it's tough, about being a force of healing and connection in a world that's often fractured. And agape love isn't some far off concept. It's right here, right now. It's in the laughter of a friend, the kindness of a stranger, the tears shared in a moment of deep connection. It's in the way the universe conspires to bring all people together to remind us that we're all in this wondrous journey of life together. This is agape love. God is agape love. And you are agape love.